Hello, my name is Andy, and I am the Village Idiot. And I'm armed with a car and a GoPro, and an unhealthy amount of time on my hands. Welcome back to Newark and Sherwood for what will be a very short video. It's a very tiny parish, this one. This is Ompton. is a tiny village and civil parish in Newark and Sherwood, Nottinghamshire, three miles southeast of Ollerton. Neesel lies to the southwest and Wellow to the northwest. The village sits on the A616 road between Ollerton and Newark. There's a small stream which runs through the village alongside Flash Lane and underneath the A616. A lot of Ompton's land area is fields, which means we can't really access anything else other than the main A616 road or Flash Lane, which is really the only turning from it. As such, it's the kind of place not many people stop in. Most traffic, and having walked along the A616 here, I can definitely say this is true, just flies through. That's not to say Ompton doesn't have anything interesting though. In fact, the parish boundaries are an odd shape, which means they do take in one very interesting landmark we'll see shortly. Perhaps one of Ompton Village's main features though would be the road itself and how it's used. The reason I say that is down primarily to speed cameras. So being located on the A616, a major road, you would expect, of course, there to be speed cameras along here. And there are, although I don't think that this speed camera sign is referring to the one that's behind me, because I think this particular speed camera, even though it looks like a speed camera, I don't think it actually is one, uh, because it's inside uh, the property of this farm here. I think it's an old one that's potentially just been moved off the road. And the reason I say that is because normally you see on the road some markings which the camera uh, is aimed at as you travel over those markings. That's what it's measuring. It's measuring your time of travel between uh, the little dashes on the road. So I don't think that one's active, um, but certainly I would not, of course, encourage you to speed through Ompton. I wouldn't encourage you to speed through any village anywhere keep to the speed limits people uh, that's a good deterrent even if it isn't it's a good deterrent uh, to not speed through here Ompton has been known in the past as Alpton as recently in fact as 1872 and was a township in Neesel Parish the manor at that time belonged to Earl Manvers in the Doomsday Book it's called Almontune the village was situated in the South Clay Division of the Bassett Law 100. Most of the land and property it covers was given to the Monastery of Rufford, with a small payment of six shillings to the Prior of Lenton. With Rufford, it became the inheritance of the heirs of Viscount Halifax of the Savile family. The village is primarily residential and has a few farms. The average house price for property is around £365,000 here in Ompton. It's so small that for census purposes its population count is included together with both Laxton and Morehouse and Ossington. I can't give you any demographic information for this one thanks to it being lumped together with those. The only stat I can offer is the area that Ompton covers which is a pretty small 2.4 square kilometres. Ompton has pretty much no amenities barring one building at the western end. That would be a red brick chapel dating to 1860. This holds a Sunday service every week at half past six in the evening. Aside from that though, there are no shops and there's no post office either. It does though have a post box which is vitally important for a village of this size. The old red phone box is no longer used and for you fans of book exchanges, I'm sorry, this one isn't one I'm afraid. It does though have a bus service, both the 334 and 335 services stop right here in the village, which means even though it's so small you can still get here by public transport.
As the parish boundaries cover a fair slice of land to the north and south of the village, they take in some other roads which are only accessed through other parishes. One of those is a small part of Ekring Road to the south of Wellow. This means that this building, alluded to earlier, is within Ompton Parish. This is about half a mile to the west of the village. It's a water pumping station owned and managed by Seven Trent Water. It was built between 1965 and 1968 as a tiled pyramid on a glazed plinth. Right, that's pretty much it. There's no point giving you a picture of it for this one because there's nothing else to show you uh, unless you like fields. <laughs> There's plenty of those around here uh, to the north and to the south and around the uh, pumping station but to be honest with you there isn't really anything else here in Ompton in the village or around. Not that I can see anyway but of course there could well be something that I haven't considered and that's where you guys come in and you can put your comments down there in the, in the comments box underneath. Uh, and let me know if there is anything else here in Ompton. But, but to be honest with you, I really don't think there is. Uh, that's pretty much it. Just a, a nice little hamlet with a Methodist chapel uh, along the A616 uh, between Ollerton and Newark. That's pretty much how I see Ompton. And I'm off to my next one. I've been Andy, also known as the Village Idiot. This has been the Parish of Ompton, and I'm out. <laughs>